Hey everybody, how's it going? Thank you so much for tuning in, and for those of you who haven't visited the channel, welcome to x Rides Cars. Today, I'm going to show you how you can install your fast track device in a Tesla Model X. So that will apply to any Tesla Model X, whether it's 2016 to now, 100, 90, whatever it is. What I'm currently in is a 2020 100D, or long range. But the problem is, you cannot just mount these things anywhere, because if you just mount it wherever you want, unfortunately the fast track sensors on the highway, when it comes to tolls or the carpool lanes now and things like that, they're just going to start charging you because they can't detect anything like this. Because when they charge, usually they do it based on license plate if you don't have a device. So I'm going to show you where you can install one of these in your Tesla Model X. So to do that, I highly recommend sticking a few pieces of Velcro on the back of it so you can mount it to that specific location easily. Now, the Model X has a long panoramic windshield. So you never know always where it could be because the kind of windshields that Tesla uses, it blocks out certain signals of certain types. So as you come up top and you notice this line right here for your rear view mirror, trace it down all the way up and at the back. So I've already put two pieces of Velcro here just to mount that. And in order to properly use this device and make it work, this is the only area you can actually mount it in for it to function properly. So because I already stuck those here, all I need to do is just simply grab this, put it up, pull a little bit of pressure since the Velcro is already there. And there we go. I have a fully mounted fast track system and I can also set it up for two or three more people based on where I'm going because one person they charge or sometimes two they charge. It really depends. But it's mounted. Now it will function as normally. And make sure it is mounted there if you do want to use it because otherwise your glass is going to block any kind of signal of any type. It's because of the kind of technology Tesla uses to make these cars. It's really interesting but also a little weird. Well, everyone, I hope you did find this video helpful. Be sure to stay tuned next time. There's a lot more where all this came from. And make sure you subscribe to x Rides Cars for some more content. I know it's been really tough because of the COVID-19 situation going on. So we're going to try to get a little more content out there. And there should be an update video coming soon. Stay safe, everyone. Take care.